Hey guys, it's Caitlin. Thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna try and record the uh, TMI tag for like the millionth time here. I have like kids coming down and like my battery runs out or my SD card runs out. So let's try this again. So um, TMI tag, I'm gonna jump on the bandwagon because everybody else does and I just wanna fit in and I wanna be one of the cool kids. So um, let's do this. Okay. What are you wearing? I am wearing gym clothes right now. I'm getting ready to go to the gym. Had a few extra minutes, figured I'd film. Um, I'm wearing just a t-shirt, tank top, sports bra, a regular bra, and then just some work back black workout pants. Um, have you ever been in love? Yeah, I am right now. I'm a lucky bitch. Ever had a terrible breakup? Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, not just even in the sense of me and my partner having a like a tumultuous breakup but you know I was married and divorced and we had children and so that is obviously just difficult on both the parents and then the kids it's just a tough situation so definitely how tall am I I'm 5'4 how much do you weigh 213.4 any tattoos yes so I have how do I even my little cupcake guy my little cupcake my Halloween special and then I have one on my ankle I don't I don't know if we can flex like be this flexible oh yeah we can be guys so can you see that it's just a little shooting star i drew it and had them put it on me when i was 18 for my birthday and then also can we talk about these shoes can you even talk about these shoes Whew. um so yeah two tattoos i would i need more i would love a sleeve um i'd love to get a piece right here but i don't know with work it's tough any piercings? Yes, my ears. I got a little safety pin happy when I was younger in high school and I pierced all up here. I pierced here. I did pierce my nose. It's still there. Uh, I can't wear it for work, so it's always empty except for the weekends. I pierced my tongue, but my mom walked in when I was doing that and she freaked the fuck out, so I had to take that out. So, OTP, no idea. We're skipping that. Favorite show? Breaking Bad, Sons of Anarchy, The Office, True Blood. All gone. That's so sad. They're no longer with us. But um, favorite bands, this is a hard one. I have like split personalities when it comes to music. I like really like hardcore rap. I like a little bit of country. I like some like alternative. But when I hear bands, it makes me think of like the reggae side of things. I love Dirty Heads, Sublime, Sublime with Rome, Revolution, uh, that kind of music um, I love. So yeah. Um, something I miss. I miss my family being together, like my extended family, my grandparents and everything. Um, I always looked forward to holidays that we had with everybody, my aunts and uncles and my cousins and everything all in one house. And I just kind of miss that. I miss everybody being connected and being just a big crazy family. I miss it. Um, favorite song? Too much pressure, I pass. How old are you? 32, zodiac sign is Aquarius. Quality I look for in a partner. Somebody who makes me laugh, somebody I can have a good time with. I'm obviously like a hot mess and a crazy person, so somebody who can handle that, but then also give it back to me so we have a good time together. Obviously, someone who's responsible and loving and cares for my children, of course, but mama's gotta have a good time. Um, favorite quote? I think it's from Vanilla Sky by Penelope Cruz. The quote, she said it in the movie and it's something like, every passing moment is another chance to turn it all around. And it's something that I kind of have to like chant to myself, realize that the here and now is not the end of my story. It is not my final chapter. I can change it and I can change it in an instant. Um, favorite actor? We're going with Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds because I just saw Deadpool and he is so fine. like so beyond handsome i am so jealous of his wife <sighs> i go like not not by their acting abilities but by their looks so like ryan reynolds johnny depp like you know favorite color i like night i like neon so like a neon yellow a neon pink something loud loud music or soft loud like the rest of my life uh, where do you go when you're sad i go to bed i feel like everybody does that how long does it take you to shower Regular day, like 15 minutes. Shaving, if it's like a shave day, then it's like until the water goes cold. Um, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning? I don't shower in the morning, I do it at night because then I'd be a hot mess. But to do my makeup and get dressed, it's probably about an hour, an hour and a half. It's too, I know, it's excessive. Ever been in a physical fight? No. Turn on, a nice smile, someone who can make me laugh, beautiful eyes soft touches long way no i'm just kidding um you know i don't know turn on i don't know turn off my boyfriend
turn off. Um, I think somebody who's like congested, like in a gross way, and you're like, <laughs> like, oh, it makes me want to gag just doing it myself. Like I can't stand like snots and like, ugh. <laughs> the reason why you joined YouTube, um, I did it more for a selfish reason. Like I really wanted to be able to see myself and the progression because I have a hard time kind of, obviously I feel like we all do visualizing the changes in our body. Obviously like there's some form of body dysmorphia I feel like for a lot of people. So I wanted to be able to really be able to view my progression and my changes as time went by. I wanted to also just kind of keep a video diary to see where my mindset was so that, you know, when I'm going through post, uh, pre ops issues and I'm, you know, talking about how I'm not feeling good or how this is my goal and this is why I'm doing it, I can look back on that a year or two years down the line when I'm struggling and not having such an easy time at keeping things on plan. I can look back on myself and say, listen, you don't want to get back to this place, this plane, <sighs> this place or this point in life. Um, and, you know, I just, I would have something to really motivate me going forward. So it was definitely selfish um, reasons to do my channel. Fears, I definitely have irrational fears about my children. Um, you know, if they're like we go to the park and they're eight and six, so they can play and I can sit on a bench and I'm watching them. If they like go down a, a you know a slide and I don't see them for a second, I'm like, my kids are gone. Who stole them? I can't run fast enough to catch up. What if they're in a van? I can't run after the van. How am I gonna ever find my kids? Like, how does somebody ever find a lost kid that's kidnapped? Like, literally irrational fears just completely go through my mind all about my kids. Something happening, do, are they gonna get struck by lightning? Uh, you know, if they play baseball, are they gonna get hit in the head with a ball? Like, there's just way too many fears that I have around my children. It's irrational, I get it. Um, last thing that made you cry, fucking PMS. Um, last time you said you loved someone just a little bit ago because I'm going to the gym so I said goodbye to my boys and my boyfriend. Meaning behind your YouTube name, Caitlin, VSG, Journey. I'm not very original so that kind of is self-explanatory. Last book you read, I think it's probably um, um, Fifty Shades of Grey. A, I'm a pervert and B, I just don't read enough so that's the only books. Those books are the last ones that I think I've read. What am I currently reading? Just not applicable. Last show you watched? Besides the fucking basketball playoffs, which shoot me in the head, um, I would say it was 60 days in I think was the last show we watched. Um, last person you talked to? My children and my boyfriend, his family, we went over for dinner. Like last non-family, like work related. Renee. Um, I went and hung out with Renee this weekend and so yeah, she was the last person, the last, the last real person I talked to. Last relationship between you and the last person, I mean the relationship between you and the last person you texted. Who did I text? Can I get back here? Can I figure this out? Let's look at my texts. My boyfriend, I don't feel like he counts. My sister, my mom, my boss. And then somebody who works for me, like so random. Um, yeah, so that's not fun. Now I have to get back to the questions. Last person who texted you. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Favorite food, pizza. I miss pizza. Place you wanna visit, Italy for sure. That's been on my bucket list since I was little. Um, last place you were, is this like travel wise? Last place I traveled to was Delaware to see my grandparents um, a few months back. That was it. If it's like last store or something, it's like Market Basket, a grocery store in the area. Like I don't go, I don't know. Do I have a crush? Yeah. Um, for sure my boyfriend, obviously, like you have to crush on the person that you're with. But like I, like a lot of people have said they have girl crushes. And there are so many of you that I totally swoon over on the daily um, here on YouTube. So yeah, I definitely have multiple girl crushes. Last time you kissed someone, just about five minutes ago. Last time you were insulted. I don't know. This is a hard one. I feel like I haven't... Well, actually, so I know this girl didn't mean it as an insult, but I kind of took it as an insult. And I think someone, who the heck was it? Somebody was just saying something about this today, or not today, in one of their videos. I think it was Drea. Maybe it was for this tag even. Um, but this, a girl that I work with, I saw her in the kitchen and she was like, you know, you look so good. And I was like, thank you so much. Like that means so much. I really appreciate it. And she's like, your boyfriend must be so attracted to you now. Like, what the fuck do you actually think? he was before. Do you not think he slept with me? You don't think he ever saw me naked? You don't think he enjoyed that? Okay, because yeah, he was attracted to me before and he's attracted to me now, okay? Like, I was just like, uh, thanks? Like, bitch, bitch please, bitch bye, goodbye.
Um, but I know she didn't mean it like that. I was just, I just was like, excuse me. <laughs> um, oh my God. Favorite flavor of sweet something with a little bit of saltiness. I, um, I would rather like have a bag of potato chips than like a candy bar. So something like a salted caramel something, something salty. Give it to me salty. Um, what instruments do you play? I taught myself to play piano when I was younger, so I can do that. I actually taught myself on a keyboard, but whatever. Um, my boyfriend tried to teach me the guitar, but like I don't have the finger length to like reach the keyboard, the keyboard, the strings. Um, I have no battery now. Let's do this. Last sport, uh, favorite piece of jewelry? Probably this. I don't really have any real jewelry, so just my ring that I've had for a really long time that I could knock a bitch out with. Um, damn, come on. What was the next? Come on, come on, come on. Um, last sport you played, probably soccer with my kids. Last song you sang, anything off of the Beyonce Lemonade album, bought it this weekend and I'm blaring that shit. Favorite chat up line, I don't have one, but Rachel, her uncle's was so funny. I can't even remember it, but if you watch Rachel Rock Creates um, tag, I was dying on the floor laughing. Have you ever used it? No, I don't have the balls to approach somebody if I was single. Last time you hung out with anyone, Renee this weekend, yay! And who should answer these questions next? Every damn person. Every single damn one of you, I would love to know more about you. I think it's a great tag. I think it's a lot of fun. I think the newbies, we can get to know you more of my generation here. Why not? It's fun. And I think the veterans even, I love that Lauren did this um, because it, it's just something to keep it fresh and then something that we can all kind of get to know each other a little bit better. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Any questions or comments, leave them below and I will talk to you later. Bye.